Hello everyone, I hope you're all well. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing part two of my ASOS haul. So if you missed last week's video, we did a load of summer dresses from ASOS and if you want to see how I got on with those, I will leave it linked down below for you. But today we are going to be trying on a few different summer tops because the main thing my wardrobe is lacking at the minute is just nice summer tops and like basic tops that can be paired with lots of things. So I've picked up a few different styles and we're going to try them on today and see if any of them are worth keeping. So this first one is a blue checkered milkmaid style top and it is cropped as well. This is from Stradvarius, I think that's how you say it, that's how I say it anyway. And I got this one in a medium and yeah, love the style of this one. One of my favourite tops I already have in my wardrobe is from them and it's a similar style but in white. So I thought if this looks nice this could be a really nice kind of basic piece that can either be dressed up or down to keep in my wardrobe. My only worry is the boob area which is my worry with pretty much every top like this because I do not have a lot in that department so it doesn't always fit quite right but hopefully fingers crossed this one looks really cute because this was one of the ones that I was most excited about getting. So this is the first top. I absolutely love this one. I think it is absolutely beautiful. It is so similar to the other one I got from Stradvarius, as I say, just a little bit different at the front. And by some miracle, my boobs actually fit in this one, which is great. But yeah, it is so flattering to wear, it makes me feel so nice. And it's actually the perfect length, as you can see. The crop ends here but if like me you live in high-waisted things it is the perfect length that it almost just looks like you've tucked it in but you don't have all that excess of fabric so yeah so so chuffed with this one this is definitely staying you will probably see it a lot on my instagram because i absolutely love it this next one is asos own brand got it in a 10 and first thoughts is wow that is just very short obviously this is the back bit it's one of those ones that ties at the front so I guess technically you don't need all that much fabric but looking at that it isn't going to cover a lot and I'm not one who likes to get my tummy out all that much so not sure how this will work but if it looks nice it'll be really good it's got sort of bat wing, bat wing styled sleeves which I am a massive fan of and I really like the kind of dusty pink colour I think this looks quite nice if you're a bit pale like me but would also look really nice with a tan and once again you could dress this down with just some denim shorts or dress it up in the evenings so thought this was another really nice versatile piece that you could have in your wardrobe. So here is the little pink tie front top it actually looks surprisingly good considering how high cut it is um, it is a little bit awkward on the shoulders for me even though it's elasticated I have this problem a lot where things just don't sit properly on my shoulders so they keep falling down and obviously it could do with a bit of an iron because it's quite wrinkly but I love the style of the sleeves and as I say this bit actually isn't as bad as I thought it was. I don't think you'd be able to get away with a bra to be honest or at least I haven't in this case I've just freed the nipples. Um, but yeah it actually has pleasantly surprised me and you know if you like this sort of top I would definitely recommend this one. It's super lightweight so it would be perfect for summer because you're not going to get too hot in it either so yeah. This next one is definitely the most basic piece that I got that I think will work with loads of different outfits and that I'm going to get loads of wear out of. So it's just a plain white crop top with a ribbed detailing and it has the little poppers on the front. I'm not sure how well you can see them but these were really in trend a few years ago and when I saw this I was like, do you know what? Why not? It's a nice stretchy material. I think it'll be really comfy. I have a feeling it may be a bit see-through but that's often the case with a lot of white tops but I just thought it was a really nice basic to have and I did get this in a 12 because I thought it looked a little bit tight in the general style on the model and I don't want a super super tight top that I'm wearing in summer because it's going to just get a little bit sweaty and gross so yeah I sized up on that one. But fingers crossed this one looks cute because I think this can be worn with loads of different things. So here is the plain little button down top. Again, it's nice in a 12 because it's a little bit roomier, not super restrictive, just a nice comfy top. It is a little bit more baggy at the bottom here as opposed to fitted, but I am happy to make that sacrifice to have a comfier top. It is a tad see-through as well, so if you're wearing a bra, I would recommend probably going with a white or a nude one. But all in all, it's a really nice comfy top. It's a nice kind of scoop level. It's not too much and again, a nice length. So another nice little basic to have in the wardrobe. This next one is the priciest one that I got and I kept putting in my basket and then was like, nah, it's too expensive. 
and getting rid of it and put it back and I was like just get it like see what you think when it actually arrives so the style of the top is as so again a sort of milkmaid or off the shoulder style top and this one is in a green and white check so it is a little bit different I do not own anything in this shade of green I don't think I own anything green actually in my wardrobe or at least not a really light shade of green but I thought this was really cute it's got a ruched what is this called where it's like stitched to be really elastic in the middle I watched sewing bee I should know this it's gone but you know the one where it's elastic in the middle so it's nice and stretchy and then it sort of flares out at the bottom um, like so it feels a really nice thick sturdy material so really nice quality which I guess makes sense for the price because I think this was about £30 which isn't massive amounts of money but it is quite pricey for your general everyday summer top and I got this in a size medium um, so I'm hoping this looks nice but I'm kind of hoping it doesn't look nice so I can return it and save myself some money but I feel like I'd get a lot of wear out of this and I like the sort of pastel tones to it as well so here is the expensive little green number I actually do really like it um, it's really comfy this bit which as I say has the style that I forgot where it's all elastically like ruched together is super comfy um, the only bit I'm not too sure about I'll move you down so you can see it a little bit is this bit here like I just I feel like the peplum sort of shape doesn't make it look nicer I think maybe if you actually tucked it in like all the way around so it doesn't exist like yeah if you tucked that in so that that bit was pretty much gone I think it looks a lot nicer and yeah, if it just had this continued all the way down, I think I would really, really love it. But I'm just not too sure about that little sticky out bit. Do you know what I mean? Let me know what you think or if I'm just being too picky. I don't really know. Next up is another ASOS own brand number. And this is a little pink wrap style top. Again, it is a crop top, but I don't know how cropped it will be because they always look really short. But then I forget how short my torso is so they don't look that weird when I try them on. I got this one in 12 again just to leave a little bit of breathing room um, but yeah I think it should be cute in theory we'll see how well it fits but it does feel really stretchy so I may have made a mistake sizing up I think you'd probably be good to go in your own size with this one because as I say the material is super stretchy but I just thought this was a nice little basic everyday top that you could just style with jeans or shorts or something like that. So here is the pink wrap top. I am really glad that I did size up to a 12 because this is super comfy to wear and it is tight fitting but not like restrictively tight. It's just a nice comfy fit to it. So I'd probably say size up if you like a comfier top. Um, it actually fits really nicely on the arms too. As I say, sometimes I have an issue where they are quite tight for me and it fits really nice on the front as well. Like yeah it's just all in all a really nice top super simple basic i'm pretty sure they do this in quite a few colors as well and yeah i'll probably be going back for a few more to be honest because i think this is just the perfect plain top that you can pair with lots of things and just looks really nice and it's a nice crop length as well it's not too short and yeah really really happy with that one this final one is quite funky i would say it is a boohoo one and i got it in a size i don't know it doesn't say I will tell you when I check and edit this video, I believe I got it in a 10 or a 12. Um, so it looks like this, it's just got a plain blue like body piece but then the sleeves are like a see-through mesh that also have little polka dots on them and obviously it was the sleeves that drew me to it, I just thought they looked super cute and yeah I'm not sure how well it will fit because this like main middle material is almost like a scuba I guess type of material, I think if you shop often with Boohoo you know the sort of material that I mean because they use it on a lot of their pieces. So I think the only issue we may have is this middle bit fitting properly. But otherwise if it fits nicely I think this will be really nice. And it's a little bit different having the mixture of mesh and like normal bits in between if that makes any sense. So here is the little boohoo top. I actually think this is really cute and a lot nicer than I thought it would be. I'm not going to lie these mesh bits are quite itchy. And I would probably have sized down because this bit here isn't really very like elastic so it doesn't kind of fit to you and it's a little bit baggy on me personally um, but all in all I think it's really cute actually as I say a lot nicer than I expected it to be I kind of just bought it on a whim because I was like oh mesh nice um, but yeah it actually is really nice um, I don't know how much wear I would personally get out of it just because these bits are really itchy and 
I don't like uncomfy clothing but if you can deal with a bit of itchiness it's definitely worth picking up because I think it's super cute and it's really different as well I've not seen anything like this one before so those were all of the bits that I picked up I really hope you all enjoyed this video and if you did feel free to give it a thumbs up down below because that really helps and also if you're new and want to subscribe that would really help me out too and I would really appreciate that but yeah I hope you all enjoyed this video and I will see you very soon with another one